Chad, uh, up here in Prince George, Canada Winter Games have been going for the last week or so. You're going to be performing here tonight. Uh, talk us through, you got in yesterday, got to take in the Cougars game. How's the experience here in Prince George been so far? Uh, it's been great. I've been to PG a few times, uh, growing up playing hockey uh, against their minor hockey team and again in junior. So um, then I was here with uh, with Dirk Spantley not too long ago, played in the, the CN Centre. So yeah, Prince George has always been uh, really good to us. When you were drafted by the Vancouver Canucks back in 2003 and that's where your sights were set back in that time of your life and now living in Vancouver what was that day like for you as an 18 year old and uh, just take us back to that yeah I'll never forget it I mean that's what a lot of Canadian kids dream of is, is getting that phone call from uh, from the NHL team saying that they, they picked you up so and yeah growing up in BC I was a, a huge Canuck fan and um, so it was, it was a feather in the cap to to get that phone call and um, you know I, had I known then what would happen today, I would have probably called you crazy. MDM Universal recording artist, Chad Brumley! Take us through uh, what people might expect from you tonight. Yeah, this is my first time performing at the Winter Games and first time experiencing it too. So it's kind of neat to walk around uh, the grounds here. There's just such a cool energy uh, in the air. So um, yeah, just expect a, a fun show. Um, you know, me and the guys in the band, we, we enjoy what we do. And I think that comes across. So um, just like to get people involved in it and, and uh, leave them wanting more. Has there been any particular songs, I guess, when you do perform in front of fans that uh, really speak volumes and are some of your favorites to perform? You know, you're really proud of these songs that you write and you perform, uh, but there's definitely a couple that come along that, that mean a lot to you. And, and there's definitely one recently on my past album called The Fighters, and, and that exact song, the title track, The Fighters, uh, I hold that one pretty close to my heart. Um, there was a young friend of mine that uh, I met when I was in university playing in Minnesota State, and he was eight years old and a big fan of the team. And, uh, ended up getting uh, leukemia and, and lost his battle 18 months later, unfortunately. And uh, he was such a, a superhero in the community, but he was one of the toughest fighters that I had ever met. And uh, so I figured he needed to have his place in that song, The Fighters, just from how much that he taught and ex inspired so many people around him. I draw off of life experiences all the time because I feel, you know, if I can feel something, uh, chances are somebody else is going to be able to feel the same thing because at the end of the day we're all humans and, and we experience a lot of the same emotions. So I, I try to draw off of those authentic experiences and in hopes that it's going to resonate with the listener. Tyson Fedor for Canada Games TV today.